Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you how to fix, you know, in case you're in an issue where your Play Store on your Android phone keeps saying, you know, waiting to download or waiting for download. Now this is a screenshot of it. So in case you run into this problem, which I heard, you know, I used to run into this problem all the time, but there are a couple ways to fix it, which is really cool. So the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you are connected to a stable network. If you're driving somewhere, if you're in a car and you're going someplace, sometimes it's hard to get connected to a reliable network in case you're home. If you might still be able to access the full Play Store and things like that, but network changes a lot. So you want to make sure you're connected to a reliable network. So you want to go into your settings app, with, you know, whether you're on One UI or your LG device or whatever, and you want to make sure you're connected to a stable network. You want to go on your internet browser, Chrome, and make sure you're connected there and make sure it's all set. And then you want to go ahead and see if you're able to go and download whatever. Now, if you are, then that's great. If you're not, Another little trick you can do is that once you open up your Play Store, you want to click the little top three little icons right here. You want to scroll down into settings, which is right there. And then once you're here, you'll see several different options. Now, now you want to make sure that where it says app download preference, you want to go ahead and tap that and you want to make sure that, you know, usually it might be over Wi-Fi only, but you want to make sure that it's clicked on over any network because this will mean that if you're using data or whatever the case is, this will mean that you can actually go ahead and download those things over any network, which is really, really cool. So you want to make sure that's connected and clicked and you want to click done right there. And then you want to see if you're able to download that specific app. If you are, then you're set. If you're not, then you want to go ahead and close out of the Play Store, go back into it and seeing if you're able to download it again. If you are, then you're good. If you're not, then another thing you'll want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your settings app one more time. You want to go find the applications panel, which should be, you know, either named apps or whatever the case is. You want to go ahead and tap that. And you want to scroll down until you find the Play Store, which will probably be like two or three things down or two or three swipes. So as you can see, it's right here. So the Google Play Store, 87 megabytes, which is probably gonna be bigger. You wanna go ahead and tap that. You wanna scroll down, and then you wanna go ahead and tap either one of these things. Now, if you're on stock Android, it might be a little bit different, but you wanna go ahead and tap one of these things, and you basically, you just want to force stop this app. So if you can see on the bottom right corner, it gives me the option to force stop it. So I'm going to go ahead and click force stop, I'm going to go ahead and click OK, and the app will actually be fully force stopped. So this means that really it's not even open anymore. It's not really being used, even if I will go ahead and multitask out of it. So you can go ahead and open it, and it'll go ahead and basically refresh the whole entire app. And from here, you should be able to fully go ahead and download these specific apps, you know, whatever you want to download. So let's say I want to download, let's say, House Party. You go ahead and click install. It'll say waiting for download for a second, and then it'll officially start downloading, which is really cool. So that's just a couple ways to fix it. You can try resetting your phone if it still doesn't work. Maybe you'll have to factory reset your device, but either or, those couple ways should be able to fix the majority of the problems that you find yourself in. So that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count, so it would mean so much if you guys get that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel, all those things are linked down below. I'd really appreciate it if you guys would check it out. More importantly than everything, else, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.